Alright, bring him out. Hold him down. Let's just get it over with. Testing. One. Two. Three. Come here. I want to take you on a trip. It won't be pretty. Look. What do we see? Testing. Test, testing. Testing. Animal testing. They get hurt. Bad. Bad. The kind of burning, eating, fear producing, page circling, screaming, screaming, screaming hurt that we shudder to even imagine. All in the name of research. Testing. One. Two. Three. Does a rabbit wear mascara in the wild? Do you hop around laying pellets in your pad? Hope not. Animals react to drugs differently than we do. Because mice are not little men. Because mice are not little men. Because they can't tell you how much it hurts. Bottom line, their systems are different than ours. Remember, it hurts. They bleed just like we do. They suffer just as we do. They feel lonely and sad just like we do. They want to live just like we do. Because when it comes to pain, hunger, and thirst, and not wanting to die, we're all basically the same. All this while more sophisticated non-animal test methods exist. Because testing on animals gives faulty results. Because it was wrong when we did it to orphans, blacks, GIs, and gypsies. And it's wrong when we do it to animals. Because we can't explain what we're doing to them. And if we could, what would we say? It is unscientific. Unscientific. You can't accurately apply the results to humans. Because life in a steel cage is no life at all. Because after all this, you know it's just plain wrong. Testing one, two, three. Testing, 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 testing.